I guess I owe you an apology because when we started this NCCR, we were asked by the money givers, the national fund by and large, to include some communication with the lay public and to address the ethical questions and issues that were arising out of our research. And we, we have hired an ethicist, his name is Ralf Stutzky, and you'll be seeing him a little later. And again, he has an original approach to what is ethics. And he thinks that communicating science to the public by means that the public can actually understand, rather than you know, giving large discourses, is a way of talking to the public and trying to address these things. So the first part of the afternoon, we had an ethics debate in the classical you know, way one would have an ethics debate. And now the second part we'll have now is a concert, and there's also some artists that have an exhibit. So I'd like to summarize the people that were heavily involved into this sound of molecule, because again, this is not something that happens without any efforts. So again, the initiative was started by Ralf Stutzky, who's a chief ethicist of this NCCR. Professor Viola Vogel, who's a esteemed scientist at the ETH Zurich, enthusiastically agreed to supervise all of this. The composition was performed by Lukas Huber, and then there'll be a movie that'll be shown that was realized by uh, Sam Herti. We provided him some molecules and some you know, cells and things moving, and he has made some, some artistic visualization. And finally, the intendant, who is also the artistic advisor, is Christian Weidmann.
So thank you very much. I would like to call on stage the production team of this phenomenal, you know, pre presentation of what we do. Many of the scientists that are part of this NCCR could recognize some of their work and it's really nice to see how other people perceive this. So I'd like to call Ralf Stutzki, who has initiated this, Viola Vogel, Lukas Huber for the composition, Sam Hertig for the visualization, and Christian Weidmann as an artistic advisor and intendant of the Orgovia Philharmonic. Yeah, thanks again to the musicians and the conductor, obviously. And I, I would like also to give a word of thanks to the Nationalfonds because so we had a, a number of panel visits. And to be honest, until the panel visit we had, so they tell us what they think of what we do, they were rather skeptical about this art of molecule initiative. And somehow it all crystallized in June. And now they seem to be very supportive of this type of you know, ethics debate and bringing uh, science to the lay public. So really a, a big thank you to the, the National Fonds and to all of you for, uh, you know, listening to this. And it's a real world premiere, and I'm sure it's going to make it very big. Thank you very much. We just listened to, to some spectacular music, unconventional, I must say. But this is maybe what exactly what we need in this field of science when we talk about chemical systems, what we are going, what was discussed already in the past two years, two days, and what is going to be discussed in the next days. Getting out of our comfort zone as chemists, I would say. That's my prime message.